Hello, I am Dr. K. Shukumar, consultant urologist, practicing in Sri Srinivasa Eurocare, second floor, opposite Ambed building, near CMH Hospital, 80 feet road, HL third stage, Indranagar, Bangalore. Majority of the patients with the kidney stones are asymptomatic. Nowadays, these stones are detected because of the ultrasound scanning available very freely in the market. And symptoms appear only when there is an obstruction or there is a superadded infection, irrespective of the size of the stone. By telling that irrespective of the size, even with the uh, size of a 3 to 5 cm which occupies the whole of the kidney, may not present with any classical symptoms of kidney stones. They might be detected uh, incidentally in the evaluation of patients with chronic kidney disease or a renal failure patients. Sometimes even with the smaller stones in the kidney give a severe agonizing pain in the abdomen because of changing in the position or a location in the kidney or on its way to go out from the kidney to ureter and to the exterior. And now coming to the stones in the kidney, they present mainly with the pain which is dull aching, non-radiating and uh, continuous type of a pain. And uh, stones in the ureter, most of the time, they are symptomatic. Only less than 30% of the stones are asymptomatic. Without any symptoms, the stones may pass off. The pain of a ureteric stones are characteristically colicky in nature. They radiate from flank to thigh, to the inguinal region, to the genital and upper part of the uh, thigh. And uh, when there, the pain is severe, these pains are associated with vomiting, with the nausea. And uh, if, this, if these stones are associated with uh, infective stones or there is a superadded infection, depending on the type of the organism and the amount of infection sets in, they will have a, a varying degrees of fever, uh, varying from mild degree to the severe sepsis and septicemia. And uh, sometimes these patients also have hematuria, that is blood in the urine with a varying degree from a, a small tinge of blood to a frank hematuria blood in the urine because of the erosion of the mucosa in the kidney or a ureter and uh, some stones in the lower one third of the ureter may present only with pain in the tip of the uh, genitals or the increased frequency of the urine, burning sensation in the urine are the only symptoms they may present with either in combination or alone. See when you have a high suspicion then only we can detect the stone in the lower one third of the ureter. Stones in the smaller kids may not have any symptoms, they present with an excessive cry is the uh, leading point to detect for the stones in the small kids. At the same time, stones in the elderly age group, they may not have any classical symptoms even with a, a gross damage to the kidney. Rather than looking for an early symptoms of a kidney stones, the patients with a high risk group like patients who are working in a heat environment, people uh, staying in a tropical country, people detected with abnormal kidneys, people detected with a metabolic diseases or genetic diseases which are prone for stones better undergo for investigations and get detected stones and get treated for the kidney stones are better than waiting for early symptoms to come into picture.